Hey folks, this is Peter from Nice Wheels, the folding bike experts, and we're out here on this beautiful afternoon on the mean streets of New York to show you the uh, Turn Joe P24. All right, so we made it out here to Carl Schultz Park, and uh, we've got the Turn Joe P24. Let me show you some things about this bike. If you're looking for a bike that's very comfortable to ride, that feels as close to a normal bicycle as possible, but you just need that super small compact storage, well, this is gonna be a whole lot better than a 20 inch or a 16 inch wheel folding bike because it has those full size wheels. Like a kind of a rough and tough commuter bike. It's not super light, it's 30 pounds, but it's really beefy and it's got a frame that's quite strong uh, for the type that folds in the middle here. Now, uh, it's not quite as strong as maybe a Montague, but it does have the advantage of being able to fold directly in half. So it's kind of like having a regular mountain bike that just folds in half for storage. The components are also quite nice on this bike, so let me show you a couple of those details, starting with the back wheel. You have an 8-speed cassette um, with a SRAM derailleur, which delivers nice, smooth, crisp shifting and a pretty wide gear range here for climbing hills. The coolest thing is on the back here, these disc brakes. I'll flip it around to show you. The disc brakes are what give you the best possible stopping power, and these are Promax disc brakes. One of the biggest things about a sturdy, tough bike that I was actually just talking to someone on the phone about today is having good quality rims and tires on your bike. Now these are WTB rims and uh, they're designed specifically for disc brakes and they've got uh, a high spoke count here to give you a really tough tire that's not going to get bent out of true from going over potholes. And you match them with Schwalbe Supreme tires that aren't quite slick. They have a little bit of tread but they're nice and fast on the road. Coming up to the front you'll see this triple chain ring. Uh, the triple chain ring is what gives you your super hill climbing gears and then your faster gears up here. Coming up to the frame, you'll see this big beefy hinge, and I always try to point this out with the, uh, the Turn Joe bikes. This hinge mates together at all these points, and it offers a very tough and uh, stiff design. Also clicks together nice and smoothly. One of the coolest things about the, t uh, the P24 are these cool red accents. It's a pretty slick and subtle bike aside from those, which just sort of pop out and make it look real nice. Coming up to the handlebar, you can see this adjustable stem, which allows you to raise and lower the stem if you want a more aerodynamic or if you want a more upright ride. You can also raise and lower it along this part of the stem if you're just really tall or really short and you want to adjust it a little bit. Uh, the handlebar here has these ergon grips with an integrated tool piece that I'm going to pull right out for you there. This tool is all you need to make those adjustments in the handlebar and uh, you know change the height exactly as you want. So it's always right there. Then you'll see these are Avid uh, brake levers. I always like to highlight these as having a very positive feeling. Something about that sound really uh, inspires confidence in my mind. The SRAM uh, shifters are what give you that uh, nice crisp shifting with a clear window to see exactly what's going on where you're at. While we're talking about the comfort and the adjustability of the handlebar, let's take a look at that seat. Now, um, I've actually raised the seat post up nice and high because I'm six foot two, but I still fit on the bike. The seat is by WTB, and while they make great rims, I'm not so enthused with this saddle. If you're looking for uh, good comfort, we have some others that we can swap in for you that'll work real nicely. It works for racing, it works for uh, you know more hardcore people, but attached to it is this little bonus. You get a light with a reflector, so now you're nice and street legal. So we've taken a look at some of the technical details. Let's fold it up. Uh, what we're gonna do is simply open this little safety latch, pop the hinge open, and then the whole thing slides around together. And there are these little magnets in the back which are holding it all together when it's folded. The bike rests on this little stand piece that's integrated. And one thing you'll notice is that this pedal is not folding. It sticks out a little bit. That's because it's a really solid pedal that delivers you know, good performance. But if you have a small space you need to fit this in, we do have some folding pedals that we can install on there for you. Uh, just check the options on the product page. So remember that every bike you get from Nice Wheels gets a full professional tune-up, which is a great thing when you're dealing like disc brakes or 24 speeds, just to make sure everything's dialed in nicely when you get it. We also repack it for safe shipping so you know that the bike's going to arrive safe and sound. Hey, thanks for watching, and if you have any more questions, don't hesitate to uh, call or email us. I'm going to head out and enjoy the rest of the day. Take care.